Welcome back to another episode of Totem Pole Sports. We've got Coach Lambo, Coach Moji, the OG, Coach Hutch. We're going to talk about tonight's Monday Night Football game against Russell Wilson and the Broncos against Justin Herbert and the L.A. Chargers. Chargers are favored by four points tonight. Starting off, Coach Lambo, who you got? I predict the future. The Chargers are going to win. That's a very easy answer because I'm undefeated when it comes to Monday Night, Monday Night Football. Very easy. I mean, you got Justin Herbert, you got Mike Williams. Keenan Allen, I think he's questionable for tonight. Um, you got number five out there. I think it's Palmer. His name is Palmer. Um, Austin Eckler, you got uh, second-year head coach in Brandon Staley. Uh, they're very aggressive when it comes to the fourth down, so they'll be going for a lot on fourth down. Um, their defense is pretty pretty legit. Um, you don't forget about Derwin James, um, Asante Samuel Jr. You know what I'm saying? Don't forget about those guys. Khalil Mack, Khalil Mack too. Yes, that is correct. But the Chargers – they do start off fast, but I am very scared when it comes to the fourth quarter because they get very, very tight. Very, very tight. They they tend to really blow leads a lot like the Raiders so do. Russell shines this fourth quarter. Russell Wilson has done nothing this year at all. And and I understand he's in a new system, but he has struggled. And the play calling has been very, very bad. So as me being undefeated on my, when it comes to my, Monday Night Football, I'm taking the L.A. Chargers, and they're going to destroy them within two possessions, probably beat them by 16 points. Okay, so you're taking that definitely going over four points. That's, that's very points. easy. That's the, easiest, that's the easiest prediction in the world. All right, no official gambling stuff here from us at Totem Pole Sports. However, Coach Mo, what do you got in retort? Well, uh, I kind of agree about who's going to win. But the whole problem is in Denver – as you know, Russell came out of Seattle. He was always in the kitchen cooking. They're not letting Russell cook. What is going on, Denver? You know why they're not letting Russell Wilson cook? Because they don't have me calling the plays. That's why. Mm, I like it. I'm telling I you like that. It. I'm telling you that. I may not call plays better than Josh McDaniels, but if they gave me an NFL job right now, I would let Russell Wilson cook. And I have common sense football knowledge when it comes to this play call. And I'm a better head coach than Nathaniel Hackett. Shots fired. Well, uh, okay. As I said, I'm agreeing with Young Buck over here that San Diego should win. They have much better players. They have a strong defense. And they have one of the best quarterbacks in the NFL. Justin Herbert well, that's how we is know top. Coach Moji, the OG, he's still calling the San Justin, Diego Chargers. Justin yeah. Herbert, by, Justin Herbert, by the way, is, <laughs> is, Justin Herbert, by the way, is top. Four, but he's not the best quarterback in the NFL. I said one. He is outperforming Russell by quite a bit. Yes, he season. is. I'll by put him in the top. I'll put, so I'll put season. Justin Herbert in the top four. I'll give I Justin Herbert credit. Three. Justin Herbert has one of the strongest arms in the NFL as well. He can throw that ball deep. But I will tell you this. Nathaniel Haggett, you need to call me right now. I will fly to L.A. right now. And I will help you call plays because you are attending the struggle and you might get fired after this season. If you don't get Russell Wilson to throw the ball and run the ball and sling it to Jerry Judy, don't forget about that. Jerry Judy, watch out. Melvin Gordon, watch out. Hey, man, I've known well, I've known about Russell for a long time, seeing him grow up as a baseball player here in Richmond, Collegiate High School. The guy can sling the ball. The guy can run the ball. The guy can do just about everything. And everybody told him he was undersized to play NFL quarterback. Dude wins the Super Bowl his second year in the league. So don't tell me about no size or anything like that. That guy can go off. And like you said, they do got to let him do his thing because right now it's not working out so well. I hate to be in agreement with everybody, but I am in agreement tonight. I think the Chargers are going to take it. I don't know if it's going to be a 16-point difference. It's going to be 16-point difference. I think it's going to be a little bit less than that. Um, I'm not banking all my money on being an undefeated Monday night football guy, but uh, we'll see what happens. when. Because uh, you're not confident. You need to be more confident. Oh, I'm see? not confident. How did we get through the tunnel this week, Lambo? Confidence. Uh, exactly. <laughs> exactly. That's all it took. All right, those videos no... are up. <laughs> exactly. Well, that's us here at Totem Pole Sports. We'll be watching the game tonight. You might get some videos from us during the game. But appreciate you watching. Definitely comment below. Let us know, again, what you want to hear. We'd love to talk about it. Coach Moji, the OG. Coach Lambo, Coach Hutch, we are out. Thank you very much for watching. Y'all take care. Peace.